We may have people here who are in those crossroads and kind of not sure. It's part of life that we're going to be faced with choices in every situation, right? We're always at the crossroads of something. But when it comes to what will propel you or draw you closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the answer of that choice should be pretty simple, right? And hijab is one definite way that we draw near to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But as I said, it might be a matter of time for you of when to do that. So you want to, you know, pace yourself, but just make a lot of du'a. If you're really, really confused about something, where's the istikhara? Where's the tahajjud? Get up and cry to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and watch what happens. Because when you do that sincerely, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will start to make things very easy for you. Don't look at hijab as something you either have to wear permanently or never wear at all. Please don't do that. Because for some people, like prayer, it comes incrementally. Some people start praying like Fajr and Aisha, and then they add on. Some people do all five at once. And I think that is a very detrimental message that women get, because you would never tell someone who is struggling with their prayer, you can't pray any of the prayers until you pray all five. Same with hijab. So wear it to the masjid. Wear it to gatherings where you feel supported. Just become infused with the hijab so that one day you wear it and you don't ever take it off, inshallah.